awareness campaign on national clean air pollution organized by district administration Dimapur in collaboration with Livingstone Foundation Society and Priest Women Welfare Association Hanbra yede Livingstone Foundation International School Laga Auditorium Hall ba program la saro team as celebrating International Day of Clean Air for Blue Skies ajila special guest ta se Mr. Tungjan Bemo Tungoy, Chief Executive Officer, the Mapur Municipal Council. I be to awareness campaign program la pura mikan detail ba sa isawa. Many of you may have been pre-informed. We have technology in our hands. We have access to uh, information at the touch of our fingers. But uh, if you have not, by now, after attending this program, after attending this awareness campaign on the National Clean Air Program, you are all aware that the Dimapur ranks highest among the districts in Nagaland in the concentration of particulate matter in here. And uh, this is much higher than the national average, I'm informed, I'm told. We are all stakeholders in this, in the fight against uh, this pollution that uh, uh, faces us now. We as uh, government fun functionaries and we as uh, responsible adults and you as children and school, uh, school students. And uh, we all have definite roles to play in achieving, achieving the objectives of the National Clean Air Program. Today I'm here to talk about some practical things which we can you and I, we all can do so that we can improve the quality of air in our city, in our town, in our state, and in our country. Uh, let me give you some statistics about the consequences of air pollution. And then, we will talk about uh, what we can do to improve the air quality. Uh, my dear students, let us be very practical here. I'm a very practical man and I want all of us to be practical as well. See, around the world, nine out of ten people breathe unclean air. We are breathing unclean air. You know that, I know that. As per statistics, 7 million deaths due to air pollution every year. Imagine 10 million in 2001, it must have been increased by maybe 8, 9, 10 million now. Each year, 6 lakhs children die of air pollution. Imagine, 6 lakhs children die of air pollution. We are using, of course, technology, it becomes our life easier. We use, see, electricity, household electricity, guards on the street, and factories are continuously emitting that emission, greenhouse gases. 99% of the people worldwide are breathing polluted air, 99%. All of us are breathing unclean air. We may think the air is unlimited in supply. We may say, hey, air, air is everywhere, air is free, it is unlimited in supply, limitless, but no one knows when the world will run out of this clean air. We never know when it will run out of this clean air. You know, I know, our planet Earth is dying every day because we don't care. We are so careless. We can't even switch off the light. We can't even switch off the fans. We can't even switch off the AC when we are not using. We can't. We don't do that. We just leave it as it is. We are not helping the earth. Let us step by step in a very small, small, small things. Let us do our part so that we will, you know, achieve our dream, the dream of saving our planet Earth. The KCCC, the small, small reminders and uh, encouragement for you to start your journey towards 
uh, you know, sustainable habits that we have been telling about. So I would want to encourage the winners starting from there and all of us can also uh, take up those habits, small things that we can do. So that is one uh, note that I would like to say.